Hi guys, in this video we have to see the income tax law on practice 2. Unit 5 Assessment of an individual Types of assessment The types of assessment is divided into 5 types. Self assessment, regular assessment, best judgment assessment, income escaping assessment or reassessment, precautionary assessment. Now we have to see the meaning of assessment. Basically, assessment is an estimation for an amount assessed while paying income tax. It is compulsory contribution that is required for the support of the government. It denotes assessment is the one of the compulsory contribution and support of the government. Types of assessment Self-assessment The assessing is required to make a self-assessment and pay the tax on the basis of the return furnished. Any tax paid by the assessee under self-assessment is deemed to have been paid towards regular assessment. It means any kinds of tax paid by the assessee under self-assessment is treated as the regular assessment. Regular assessment on the basis of the turn of income chargeable to tax furnished by the assessee. An intimation shall be sent to the assessee informing him about the tax or interest payable or refundable to him. Best judgment assessment. In a best judgment assessment, the assessing officer should really base the assessment on his best judgment. That is, he must not act dishonestly or vindictively or cabriously. There are two types of judgment assessment. First one is compulsory best judgment assessment. A yeah, compulsory best judgment assessment is made by the assessing officer in case of non cooperation on the part of the assessee or when the assessee is in default as regards supplying information. Discreatory best judgment assessment. The discreatory best judgment assessment is done even in cases where the assessing officer is not satisfied about the correctness or the completeness of the accounts of the assessee or where no method of accounting has been regularly and consistently employed by the assessee. Income escaping assessment or reassessment. If the assessing officer has reason to believe that any income chargeable to tax has escaped assessment for any assessment year, assess or reassess such income and also any other income chargeable to tax which has escaped assessment and which comes to us notice in course of the proceedings or any other allowance as the case may be. Precautionary assessment. The precautionary assessment where it is uh, not clear as to who has received the income, the assessing officer can commence proceedings against the persons to determine the question as to who is responsible to pay the tax. Thank you guys for watching this video.